Good evening. This is Cockbag from Channel 9 Cock Sucker News. Right, now, we've just got a little update to tell you about COVID. Now, Sydney's had 666 new local cases today. Now, that's verified by one of our local fact checkers. Oh, hi guys. Yes, this is Penelope Pat. Now, I'm an independent government fact checker. Now, I'd like to say that everything Gladys is saying is factually correct. Now, I haven't had any payment or I've not got any bias to the government just because I'm hired by them, right? Now, just just obey the, obey the orders just to keep us safe, all right? Now, everyone, we're just going to say that Sydney is in a bit of a pickle at the moment, right? The police have been deployed for your safety. Now, it's only for your safety you should be vaccinated and the health of other people. Now, we're not trying to force anything on you, but this lockdown could go on, well, forever. Now, even when we get to 80% vaccination, there's still going to be restrictions, but that's just totally normal in this new world. Now, old Mark McGowan, old Mark of the Beast, he's deciding it too. He's going to keep the border closed just to keep his people safe from Western Australia. Now, don't get out there and do some fuckbaggery and fuck us off. Just keep submitting because everything's going to be all right. Trust the plan. Yes, that's right, Gladys. Western Australia has implemented draconian void ab initio laws which resemble Nazi-style vaccine passport papers. Now... I know that Australia was a free country, but before COVID hit, Western Australia is now basically separating the borders due to having a vaccine passport. Now, just go out and get jabbed, just so you can get all your rights and privileges back. It's not like Nazi style, well, it kind of is, but you know, that's WA for you these days.